Welcome back to my channel guys, so in today's recipe I'm going to be showing you guys how to get done, how to cook, or how to make stir fry fries. So if you want to know how to do it, if you want to know how to get it done, stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, activate the notifications, leave your comment down below, and if you want me to keep making more recipes like this, or if you have a recipe that you would like me to make for you, just let me know and I will make it happen. Don't lose any more time, and let's do it. These are the ingredients that we are going to be using on today's recipe, guys. And right here we have shrimp, soy sauce, salt, sugar. We have over here onions, frozen vegetables. We just have peas and carrots over there. Two eggs. And right here we have cold rice. Uh, you don't want to... Uh, Execute this recipe with uh, one rice because it won't it would just it, it won't taste good guys So make sure that if you are planning on making a stir fried rice You cook your rice the night before so that way you can put it on the refrigerator and your rice can be ready to go Whenever you're ready to start cooking the Thing that you want to do guys is you want to add oil to your pan olive oil you want your pan to stay to have enough oil. So you basically want the oil to go all the way across. And you want to have you want to have your pan on high. And after that, you want to get your two eggs and you are going to Shake it. Now that your oil is hot, you're going to add the egg to the oil. You want to do it slowly. You want to make sure to start cooking. Pretty good. Sure, your heat is not really high because you don't want to burn the egg. You just want to be able to cook this egg. to the side now that your egg is already it's not really well done it's just that's why my heat is so low you are wanting to add the onions and the frozen vegetables and you're just going to cook it on the side. And you're going to cook these. You're going to fry them for at least 3 to 5 minutes. Put the heat a little bit high. How beautiful those colors look in there, guys. It's amazing the way it looks. Make sure you get all the ingredients alright now that we have our eggs is already you know cooked and our vegetables our frozen vegetables are um, cooking well now you are wanting to add the shrimp you wanting to add the shrimp and you don't want to overcook shrimp because if you overcooked it it will not taste good guys it will be too chewy 
So you want to make sure you don't over tube it. Just cook it until it gets a little bit. Guys, now that your shrimp is cooked, remember you don't want to let it cook too long. Now, what you are wanting to do, you are wanting to look at all the juices. You are wanting to add, you want to stir everything. You want to stir everything together. Make sure everything gets incorporated. Guys, this look beautiful and they smell amazing. It looks beautiful. It smells amazing. Look at that. Trim stir fry. Oh, you are want to cook that for two more minutes. Now that we are all that all the vegetables are pre-cooked. We're good to go now. We are gonna add our rice. Remember, guys, it's very important that your rice is cold from the night before, or at least five to six hours in the refrigerator before you try to make this recipe. It's very important that you do that. And at the same time, you are going to add a little bit of salt, a little bit of sugar. And now you're going to stir because you want to stir together. Beautiful. And you are wanting to Stir first before you put the soy sauce in it. So that way everything starts cooking. If you have any bumps of rice because it's cold, make sure you do this to the rice. Now that everything looks to be all together, you want to start adding the soy sauce slowly. You don't want to put too much. You want to add a little bit and you want to stir. So you can start getting the color. Wow guys, this, this smell amazing. Do you do that? You wanna add a little bit more soy sauce? You want to stir. You stir. <laughs> wow. All right, guys. Our shrimp stir fry is ready to be served. After cooking all together for like 10 to 12 minutes it's ready to be served you want to turn off the stove and you are gonna get a plate and you're gonna serve that looks beautiful guys it's simple it's a very easy recipe to make Something that you can do at home if you don't want. It's very cheap.
All right, guys, this is my shrimp stir fry. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Remember, guys, subscribe to my channel, activate the notifications, leave your comment down below. And if you want more recipes like this, just let me know, guys, and I will make it happen for you. Remember, if you don't try, you will know if you can get it done. If you want more videos like this, let me know, and I will make it happen. See you next time.